For any country to maintain a competitive advantage over others, it must possess high-quality aircraft that can outperform and defeat those of rival nations. However, quality often comes with a hefty price tag. The development of advanced aircraft demands substantial financial investment during manufacturing, and their operational costs can be equally expensive. To gain a better understanding of the costs associated with purchasing and operating top-notch aircraft, it is important to explore the most expensive military aircraft ever constructed. So buckle up, subscribe, and let's explore the 12 most costly military aircraft ever constructed. V-22 Osprey The V-22 is currently operated by the US and Japan, with potential future sales to other countries. Each V-22 aircraft costs approximately $84 million, with the overall program valued at around $35.6 billion and operating costs are $11,000 per hour. This multi-role combat aircraft features a tilt rotor system, allowing it to take off and land vertically like a helicopter, but with the range, speed and maximum takeoff weight of a fixed-wing aircraft. It first flew in March 1989, but crashes during flight testing and unstable funding caused several delays until it entered service with the U.S. Marine Corps in 2007. It measures 57 feet in length, 84 feet in width, and 22 feet in height. It has an empty weight of 33,069 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of 52,600 pounds. The aircraft is equipped with two three-blade propeller systems and two Rolls-Royce engines, each producing 6,150 shaft horsepower. It can reach speeds of up to 316 miles per hour, has a range of 1,100 miles, can climb at a rate of 3,160 feet per minute, and can reach an altitude of 25,000 feet while carrying a crew of four and up to 24 personnel. Chengdu J-20 Black Eagle This Chinese multi-role stealth fighter costs around $110 million per aircraft, with overall program expenses estimated at $4.4 billion. This advanced fighter plane is designed for high performance in hostile conditions and had its maiden flight in January 2011 and entered service in 2018. It measures 75 feet in length, 49 feet in width, and 16 feet in height. It has an empty weight of 38,801 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of approximately 77,162 pounds. The aircraft is equipped with fire control and engine management systems, as well as active electronically scanned array radars, enabling it to quickly detect and engage targets. The J-20 can reach high altitudes of around 59,055 feet and achieve supersonic speeds of approximately 1,305 miles per hour. Its armament includes long-range PL-12C-D and PL-21 air-to-air -air missiles, PL-10 short-range AAMs, internal cannons for close-range combat, laser-guided bombs, drop bombs, air-to-surface missiles, and anti-radiation missiles. F-35 Lightning The F-35 Lightning aircraft comes in three variations. The F-35A, which costs $89.2 million, the F-35B at $115.5 million, and the F-35C at $107.7 million. Each aircraft costs approximately $35,000 per hour to operate, with the overall program cost projected to reach $1.5 trillion over its 50-year lifespan, making it one of the most expensive military acquisition programs. As a fifth-generation advanced multi-role strike fighter, the F-35 features advanced stealth technology and a state-of-the-art 360-degree sensor system, providing unparalleled attack disruption capabilities. It is equipped with one of the most powerful integrated sensor packages and very low observable stealth technology, enabling superior air-to-air, air-to-ground, and intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance operations. Its electronic warfare systems allow it to evade detection by radars that other jets cannot avoid. 
compared to other aircraft, the F-35 has a smaller radar cross-section, making it less detectable and allowing it to take action before being picked up by enemy radars. The aircraft weighs between 22,500 and 30,000 pounds and has a maximum takeoff weight of 60,000 pounds. Powered by a Pratt and Whitney F, 135-100 turbofan engine that produces 40,000 pounds of thrust with an afterburner, it can reach speeds of around 1,200 miles per hour. It has a range of up to 1,864 miles and a service ceiling of approximately 50,000 feet. E2D Advanced Hawkeye the E-2 Hawkeye was initially developed by Northrop Grumman for the U.S. Navy in the late 1950s. Its first flight took place in October 1960. This twin turboprop aircraft features an all-weather, carrier-capable tactical airborne early warning system, which enables the U.S. Navy to execute advanced battle management command and control capabilities. In August 2007, the $232 million E-2D Advanced Hawkeye made its first flight, showcasing numerous technological upgrades, including enhanced communication and coordination with littoral, overland and open sea vessels. These upgrades also incorporated electronic and mechanical active scan radars. The E-2D model boasts a fully integrated all-glass tactical cockpit, advanced mission computers and tactical workstations, electronic support measures enhancements, and a modernized communications and data link suite. It is 57 feet long, has an 80-foot wingspan, and stands approximately 18 feet high. It has a maximum takeoff weight of 57,500 pounds and can reach a maximum speed of 402 miles per hour. The aircraft carries a crew of five, has a ferry range of 1,700 miles and a service ceiling of around 34,700 feet. VH-71 Kestrel Priced at $241 million, the Kestrel was intended to replace the U.S. President's helicopter fleet. However, President Barack Obama halted its production, opting to use the funds to maintain the existing fleet instead. He made this decision due to the Kestrel's soaring production costs, which exceeded the White House's budget. The aircraft, after several delays, caused overruns and engineering issues, including extensive modifications requested by the U.S. government, had its first flight in July 2007. The project was ultimately cancelled in June 2009 after the total cost for the planned 28 helicopters escalated to $13 billion. In June 2011, the helicopters were sold to Canada for $164 million to be used as spare parts for the Augusta Westland CH-149 Cormorant search and rescue aircraft. The Kestrel was capable of carrying four crew members and was equipped with three robust General Electric CT-78E turboshaft engines, each providing 1,879 kilowatts of takeoff power. The aircraft measured 64 feet in length, 61 feet in width, and 21 feet in height, with a maximum takeoff weight of 34,392 pounds. It could reach a maximum speed of 193 miles per hour and had a range of 900 miles. P-8A Poseidon The P-8A Poseidon is a militarized version of the Boeing 737-800 ERX, produced by Boeing for the U.S. Navy with a procurement cost of around $290 million per aircraft. It is 129 feet long, 42 feet high, and has a wingspan of 123 feet. It has a maximum takeoff weight of 189,200 pounds and can fly at altitudes up to 41,000 feet with a ferry range of 4,500 miles. The aircraft conducted its first flight in April 2009 and was introduced to the U.S. Navy in November 2013. It is designed to detect and attack hostile submarines and perform electronic support measures, including early warning self-protection, shipping interdiction, and anti-surface or anti-submarine warfare. It is equipped with radar-guided air-launched missiles for combat operations. 
It is powered by two CFM International High Bypass Turbofan engines, each producing 27,000 pounds of thrust. It has a cruise speed of approximately 600 miles per hour and can travel 200 feet over the sea at speeds of 210 miles per hour. C-17 Globemaster III The Globemaster III is one of the biggest military transport planes globally, capable of transporting soldiers, military equipment and vehicles worldwide. The C-17 entered service in January 1995 and is jointly manufactured by McDonnell Douglas and Boeing Defence Space and Security. The aircraft has a flyaway cost of approximately $218 million, with an estimated total programme cost ranging between $328 million and $368 million over its lifetime. Renowned for its high reliability and maintainability, the C-17 measures 174 feet in length and has a wingspan of 169 feet 10 inches. It is powered by four Pratt and Whitney F-117 PW100 turbofan engines, each producing 40,440 pounds of thrust. The aircraft features a large aft ramp and door system, allowing for the heavy loading of Air Force equipment and the capacity to carry and airdrop 102 paratroopers. It has a maximum payload capacity of 170,900 pounds and a maximum takeoff weight of 585,000 pounds. It can reach a service ceiling of 45,000 feet at cruising speed with an unrefueled range of around 6,300 miles and a cruise speed of 450 knots. F-22 Raptor Considered the world's best fighter plane, the Raptor was built to counter Russia's advanced SU flanker and MiG fulcrum aircraft. Lockheed Martin and Boeing manufacture the Raptor, with each aircraft costing around $350 million and the total program cost is approximately $66 billion. It is a stealthy, all-weather, twin-engine, single-seat, fifth-generation aircraft designed for the US Air Force. It features capabilities in signal intelligence, electronic warfare and ground attack and is primarily used as an air superiority fighter. The aircraft measures 62 feet in length, 16 feet in height, and 44 feet in wingspan. It weighs 43,340 pounds and has a maximum takeoff weight of 83,500 pounds. The F-22 has a range of 1,800 miles and a climb rate of 62,000 feet per minute. It is powered by Pratt and Whitney F. 119-100 engines, enabling it to reach supercruise speeds of Mach 1.82 while carrying a full load of weapons without using an afterburner. Air Force One Air Force One is made of two Boeing VC-25 aircraft used to transport the US President. These planes are highly modified military versions of the Boeing 747, 200, equipped with advanced communications and air defense capabilities. These planes entered service in 1990, with each aircraft costing $325 million and the total production cost for both aircraft reaching around $660 million with the operational cost is up to $206,000 per hour. It has a maximum takeoff weight of 826,000 pounds and is powered by four General Electric CF 680C2B1 engines, each producing 56,700 pounds of thrust. This allows the aircraft to achieve a top speed of 629 miles per hour. It can fly at altitudes of up to 45,100 feet and has a flight range of 8,000 miles, which is significantly extended by its in-flight refueling capabilities. It measures 232 feet in length, 195 feet in wingspan and 63 feet in height. The aircraft is equipped with flares to counteract heat-seeking missiles and features electronic countermeasures radar jamming technology. These planes will soon be replaced, as Boeing is set to build two replacement presidential aircraft from the 747, eight models, at an estimated cost of around $3.9 billion. 
Northrop Grumman B-21 Raider The Northrop Grumman B-21 Raider is an American strategic bomber currently under development for the United States Air Force by Northrop Grumman as part of the Long Range Strike Bomber Program. The B-21 is designed to be a long-range, stealth intercontinental strategic bomber capable of delivering both conventional and thermonuclear weapons. The Air Force is planning the B-21 to replace the Rockwell B-1 Lancer and Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit by 2040, with the potential to eventually replace the Boeing B-52 Stratofortress as well. Many details of the B-21 program are highly classified, with the program designated as a special access program, making the B-21's technical specifications, including speed, enabling systems, size, required stealth, structure, number and type of engines, projected weapons and onboard sensors remain undisclosed. With an estimated cost of $700 million per aircraft, Air Force officials have projected that they will spend at least $203 billion over 30 years to develop, purchase and operate a fleet of at least 100 Raiders. B-2 Spirit the Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit is a heavy penetration stealth bomber used by the U.S. Air Force. Designed to infiltrate complex and dense air defense systems, the B-2 can perform attack operations at altitudes up to 50,000 feet. Initially costing $737 million per unit, it became the most expensive aircraft ever built due to retrofitting, adjustments, and a reduction in the number of planes purchased in 1997 with the overall cost rising to $2.1 billion per plane, with an operating of $135,000 per hour. It employs two main defenses against radar detection, a costly stealth coating known as alternate high-frequency material and its continuous curvature design. The aircraft can reach speeds of up to 628 miles per hour and measures 69 feet in length, 172 feet in width, and 16 feet in height. It has a maximum takeoff weight of 376,000 pounds and is powered by four General Electric F-118 GE110 turbofan engines, each providing 17,300 pounds of thrust. The B-2 Spirit has a flight range of 6,900 miles and a climb rate of 3,000 feet per minute. This two-pilot stealth bomber can carry up to 40,000 pounds of weapons, 